hello welcome back to my channel today we are doing a grocery haul we've not done one in a while i'll also be picking some bits and bobs so come along with me it promises to be exciting let's go The first place I'm stopping is Mega Plaza. I've not been to Mega Plaza in a very long time. I think the last time I came here, I was probably pregnant. So I just really wanted to come um, get some stuff and also see what is new. And it was just exciting. I love doing this. My daughter loves doing it as well. So <laughs> we're like, let's go together. One of the reasons I came here was to get like plates and food flasks, you guys. So I had to get um, for my kids, I got for myself as well this pink one. It was so cute. You guys know that there is rice at home. You don't need to buy food outside a lot. You just make sure you cook at home, meal plan, meal prep, so that you always put it in your flask and you take it along with you because <laughs> things are very expensive you guys if you do not have a meal plan i do not know what you're doing because it saves you time saves you money i have one download it the link will be in the description box as you can see i'm in love with pink this is my favorite shade of pink so anything pink i'm going to be touching i'm going to be looking at it thought this bottle was so cute well my daughter thought it was so cute and I'm like hmm maybe next time but it was really really nice and then I've been looking for these um, mugs that look like camera lenses if you want one come and check they have it at Mega Plaza and I was just looking at mugs basically you guys I have a mug collection like I have a lot of mugs in my house I use my mugs according to my mood and I'm just happy to add this to the collection Collection. these were mugs that if you buy them the money that you pay goes to charity so I wanted to support the cause I thought the inscription on this laundry basket was funny I wanted to get it but I changed my mind because I have so many already and then I was just looking at you know plates and stuff they have so much from electronics to kitchen to homeware so I picked up what I wanted now we're going to the next place we're going to Hartley's I usually come to Hartley's to pick up like variety of vegetables and fruits and things that I would normally not find in other stores so I like to get them from here this holiday we've been working on a children's cookbook well and <laughs> we finally done it which is why i came here so i came here to get a lot of the ingredients that i wanted to use in the cookbook you know sometimes when you're making cookbooks you need the freshest and the prettiest of ingredients they are more expensive but we're doing it for the book if you want to see more about the book or if you want to get a copy of the book it's an ebook the link will be in my description box 
so we have our children's ebook by now but in this video we were preparing for it we were shopping for shooting so some of this stuff is not what I buy every day it is just what I need for my photo shoot the cookbook is a collection of recipes breakfast lunchbox recipes that your kids will love if you get a copy you will never run out of ideas again because even the lunchbox recipes are already assembled so you can pair them the way you see it in the book I get loads of questions about where can I find cheese in Lagos you guys this is where I buy cheese I buy cheese from here or I buy it at um, spa yes I buy cheese from spa but here they have like lots of variety I get that question especially on my pizza video if you've not seen my pizza video you guys it has over 3 million views go and check it out <laughs> and they have like a variety of pasta you guys if you are looking for pasta heaven come here i wanted some fun shaped pasta for the children's cookbook so i came to pick up some stuff so yeah that's why i come to hartley's based on the variety of things they have and sometimes uh the quality of the ingredient the way it looks for photography that is what is important to me i do not buy my main shopping here because it is expensive <laughs> It is expensive. So yeah, I just come here for special items, white onions, different types of things basically. So that is it for Hartley's today. I promised you guys I was going to show you where I buy my fish and seafood from. I typically will go to all those markets where you get fresh seafood but lately this is where I've been coming and I've been coming here because it is a convenient way of me getting like my seafood already cleaned. Like I do not have time for stress right now. I do not have the time and energy to go to a market and you know you know the whole stress of going to a very far market just to buy it in bulk i like here because they have a bunch of variety so many items they have this uh smoked mackerel pepper smoked mackerel that i really like it reminds me of the smoked mackerel i think i used to buy it from is it tesco or aldi in the uk back in those days so i like to buy it from here i use it to soak a gari i use it in noodles and it's just convenient to buy it and their fish and seafood is always very fresh they have different sizes they have the ones they have the veins the one they've not the veined different types you guys Guys. so that is why I come here because if I go to the market I don't have a particular place where I can find everything that I can find in this particular fish shop the price is on the wall you don't need to stress too much everything is just where you need and that's the purpose of a convenience store right I'm kind of in a phase where convenience is very important to me you guys know <laughs> I had a baby in February and I'm doing a lot of work so sometimes I don't get time to go main markets now here will they come and the price is not bad at all compared to play other places look at the price like they have seafood mix they have like the vein headless peeled like you can see the variety I'm showing you right this is where I get my seafood from so not just seafood as in shrimp and prawns and stuff like that I also get different types of fish here so I will show you that in a bit Lately, I've been using barracuda fish a lot. So what I do is I just get different bags of different types of fish and I put it in my freezer for one month. It has been a lifesaver because sometimes I just need to make a soup and then I just put my different types of fish in the pots this is honestly one of the things that's been saving me time and i just like the fact that there's a variety of um different types of fishes that i can get they have barracuda they have tuna they have salmon they have uh mackerel they have uh what's it called again you guys so many things are big 
<laughs> you can see it on the wall so many so many types of fishes that they have here um and i just buy it in bulk take it home put it in the freezer truly don't know anywhere else especially in lagos where you will find options like this you guys especially that have been cleaned i really do not know where you can find them so this is the one shop and this one is the branch in vi they have different branches but it's the vi one that i go to because they have like a bunch of variety they also say they have variety in the other stores but i don't go to the other ones and i like come into this one because i noticed that in lagos what what you will get in the shop right in Ikeja is different from what you get in the shop right in let's say Ikoi and it's different from the shop right in the trenches it's different from the shop right in the um what they call it hybro areas so I like to come to this one because they will always have like maximum variety here to cater to all their expatriates you know <laughs> so yeah just showing you where I get my fish Like I said, I'm going for convenience. You guys, this croaker filet that they have here, I bought it the last time. And there was one day I went out. When I came back, we had to cook um, because I had so many things planned that day, but I was so tired. All I had to do was bring this fish out and put it in the air fryer and dinner was ready. One fish per person. That was all. It was so easy. Like see things have been very very busy and hectic over here so anything that makes life easy for me is where i'm going right now if you know anywhere else where i can get let's say seafood more affordable than this the price has been on the screen on their walls if you know somewhere else let me know in the comment section Let me tell you the story about the salmon I bought here, you guys. <laughs> so I bought the salmon and I was thinking, oh, I'm going to use it for a pasta recipe. I can't wait to use it for a pasta recipe. One day, I just sold the salmon in the freezer. I was like, this salmon is calling me. Let me see, eat me, eat me. I put soya spice on it. I put some oil. I put some salt and seasoning. And I put it in the air fryer. In like 10 minutes, our soya salmon was ready. Guess what we ate it with? We used it to soak a jebu gari. <laughs> It was amazing, you guys. It was amazing. We just sat down, soak gari, one piece of salmon per person. The thing went down well. And I think going forward, that's what I want to be doing. Salmon and ijebu gari, lit combination. Right now, I'm into red snapper for some reason. I really like red snapper. <laughs> Before, it was barracuda, but now I'm on red snapper. Let me know what your favorite fish or seafood is. Or let me know, do you not eat fish? Because there are some people that don't eat fish. When I'm coming, I always come with like my big cooler and I put ice in it because it takes a while for me to get home because I have to do a lot of shopping that day. So basically I just buy in bulk, take it home and this is what I spent there. This fish lasts over a month for me. So this is the fish we used for so many things, for soups, for rice, anything we're eating basically. We still have things like chicken and different options but this is 
the fish that we would buy but i bought more this time because i was filming loads of recipes so it's understandable that is a lot this time but this is where i get my fish so this is my grocery haul in one day i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did click the like button don't forget to leave me a comment and i'll see you guys in my next video bye